hello everyone welcome again in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, get data from uh, Excel file and uh, perform the login operation so we will read the data username and password so I already make uh, I already made a video on this topic but I'm going to uh, continue this because I got a comment like how to perform uh, the login operation with uh, multiple data like in Excel file I have a the hundreds of records and I want to perform the login operation same login page with the same data in a single script so in Catalon how can we perform this task so for example uh, here I'm creating an excel file so my excel file name is demo and you can see I want to open it you can see there is a username and password three passwords are there uh, three usernames are there okay so we are going to read the data from this excel file so just create a demo excel file and save uh, save this and uh, you can create any name and remember the seat name also so just close this and come on catalog so create a new project complete new project for creating a new project go file new and click on project so you will get this kind of window and and this test case folder you need to create a test case so I create a test case which name is new test case so I'm going to record a login script here so just click on record and click on start so you can see the browser is open and URL is loading it's done URL is captured click on make appointment button now enter the username here John Tom and the password this is not a password. click on login it's okay okay and now now I want only this I just want to perform only login operation so click on stop and okay store the object repository and uh, you can see the script here my next step will be I need to pass this username and password by using a variable so in catalog how to use this variable Let's go in the variable section so to create a variable click on the variable and add uh, here you need to pass two variables so click on two time add this name username or you name anything and password it's a password and click on save so you need to pass this variable name inside your script like you name here I want to use you name and here I want to use password and now you need to connect this this uh, username and password with uh, the data which I showed in first in Excel file so you need to map them uh, to map them you just need to create a data file so right click on the file data file create a text data and I'm going to pass here data only so in data browse the file uh, where you save the excel file or the file from which you want to get the data so as I select the file you can see the data here the number 123 username and password and the seat also selected c21 c2 and again save this data and the seed one right yeah. automatic it's changing way yeah and uh, <coughs> now create a test suit right click and test suit so you can give any name this is default name is new new test suit click on add select your test case okay now you can see here the show data binding click on this click add and add the data which you create inside your data file 
here you can see the variable name where you want to wind the data so my name I define the variable with the name username and password the default value is uh, nothing and I need to select the value here from this file data file uh, from this data file so I select the, the set type here data column when I select the set type data column the pop-up is enabled here for the test data so here I need to select the file in which file I want to select the data so data file data okay here I need to pass the value so in this file there is a two value uname and password so I select the uname and the second one also I need to select the data column and then data file and then the column name or you can say the variable name password uh, again save this now just execute your test case uh, by using the test suite this time the test case will mm, automate or you can say script will run three times you know, don't need to use any loop and anything any hard coding just need to create a suite and pass the data by the suite you can see it's automate it's try once again it's going to try second time for the second data you can see and again it's going to execute the third time so the execution depends on the data which you stored how many number of rows in your uh, excel file so i i i write only three i wrote only three rows that's why it's execute only three times so if you want to write the data inside this you need to hard code some code or you need to perform some keyword operation how to perform that keyword operation you can watch that previous videos like how to read data from excel in catalon or uh, how to write data in catalon in excel or you can read the complete article on code one also i'm going to show you open the code1.com i will provide the exact link and just go in automation and my internet is slow and select the catalon studio here you can see the read and write data from excel the tutorial number nine and here is the complete procedure read and write data from excel and get on a studio and there is a step by step with screenshots you can easily understand what's going on here or if you want to write the data you need to create a custom keyword and you need to use this method here so it will help to write the data inside your uh, excel file like for example i want to write something so how can i use this so i'm just going to copy this section and uh, here i'm going to create a keyword a new keywords create a keyword and keyword package is demo or keyword is added uh, sorry as right excel data the package name should be demo okay here i'm going to just copy paste this Here I need to pass some excel files or you can see uh, some dependencies selenium dependencies and other dependencies so I'm going to import that on the required jars
or you can copy from here also okay here I need to pass my file location and here also I need to pass my file location where I want to store my data demo and demo so I just need to pass the call the method inside my test case and pass a string or a name or a value or data which I want to store in my uh, excel file so this is we see the example so you can see here how to call that custom keyword so you need to create a custom keyword and like here like for example after the execution of the test case I want to store something dot custom dot so custom keyword dot demo dot the complete name of this class I want to write here so you can see that I want to copy the format only Here my package name is demo and it's not taking something and the file name is write excel and the name is demo key I want to pass a string only so the string is do this again okay the test case is executed now check the file again so you can see the data hello and uh, the data is write it successfully so thank you so much for like uh, for watching this video and if you like please subscribe the channel and share with your with whom you want to learn the kitlon uh, uh, automation and